What's going on, Scorpio gang, gang, gang? Hope all is well with you guys. To my returning OG subscribers, what's popping? What's good? To my newly subscribed, hey y'all, thank you for allowing the channel to continue to grow. I really appreciate that. To my members only community, it goes without saying, I love, love, love you guys. To the moon and back, you know that. This is a Scorpio affair, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Anywhere you have Scorpio placements in your chart, grab your boo, your hookah, your blunt, your wine, your spliff, your coffee, your OJ, your cat, your dog, Scorpio. As long as we tap in, it's all good with me. If you should see an ad, family, let it play for a minute or so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube. If you like a personal reading with me or like to purchase... <laughs> a spiritual box you need to be a part of the members only community okay those memberships start at 9.99 guys get over there before the launch all right if you donate to the channel make sure you comment a money emoji i will be randomly picking people for free readings free spiritual baths and for free memberships so make sure you check that out, guys. All right, anything else you need to know is in the description box below. And to all you guys who like, share, subscribe, and donate to the channel, mm, big kisses. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Let's see what's going on with you, Scorpio. Uh, I'm, I'm hearing Scorpio be natural. <laughs> That's enough. Or maybe it's too much, but at least you got, I'd rather have too much than not enough. That's what I deserve. Just be you. Be natural. Just, yeah. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know why I'm hearing that, but let's see. What's the messages? Just be just be you, Scorpio. Be natural. So I feel like you meeting somebody that you feel like it's somebody like it's like a you know, some type of this got to be some type of official or somebody you try you want to impress Scorpio, and see what 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 I really feel like is this person got enough of that going on, and and they find you refreshing because of your energy. But see, your mouth got to match your energy. Don't don't be no don't just be natural, Scorpio. That's what I'm hearing. Just whoever you are. That's that's it's already too much, but it's sufficient for what's going on. All right, moving forward. What are the messages here? Yeah, it's like an emperor or something, you know what I'm saying? Why you, you know, at the house with a page who talking shit and can't help do nothing and all this. It says, tower moment, child, when God moves people out of your life, let them go. Okay, so right there off the bat, Scorpio, it's something you need to release someone. The next energy is fraud. You know they broke and fake flexing, right? What I say, you know, with a page. And I feel like this emperor trying to get your attention, but I feel like you trying to class it up or like try to, you know, like alter your appearance or something like that. I'm getting like cover a tattoo or some shit like that. I don't know. But I'm just saying like, I'm here just be your natural self. Like. It, it it's it's too much, but it's sufficient. I keep hearing that, <laughs> cause you dealing with a fraud right now. Anyway, I mean, anywhere, in, any anything past this person is is an upward movement. Anyway, so <laughs> moving forward, they finna get their tower moment. It says toxic family members jealous of your come up. You laughing all the way to the bank. So somebody, I'm telling you, somebody going to hit the lottery or somebody going to um, blank off in Vegas or something like that. I'm, I'm hearing that strong because I feel like somebody overcame gambling. I keep getting that for this collective. And so I feel like you, you stop gambling or you stop drugging. You stop doing something to make way for your dreams. And now that your dreams happen, you don't desire to do those type of things. But every now and then, you'll go somewhere like Vegas. And you'll go in there where you used to go and go crazy. Now you go in there and spend 200 bucks and leave with six or 7000 It's that type of energy. You're pulling the twin flame card here. This, this emperor, this new person, they could be your twin flame, Scorpio. Let's see. 
Yeah, you're walking away from somebody, yeah. Whatever they try to tell you to get to come back or however they try to persuade you, it's just a it's just a solid ass no for you. Cause I feel like I feel like not only have you upgraded and leveled up from settling, but I feel like this person is it's almost like y'all doing each other a favor here. Yeah, this person could be your twin. It says obsessed with your beauty here. Because I feel like this person been loving you for a long time, Scorpio, if you get my drift like past lives. I feel like you and this person are have some type of, um, I mean, it could be twin flame, but I just feel like it's, it's only obsession because of how long it's been. That's what I'm getting. Like... You, we gotta stop thinking in these life years where we on Earth. It's other lives you don't lived and times in it, and these certain people just tend to follow you, Scorpio, around. It's like every life you come from, whatever, however you look, as long as it's you being natural. I'm also hearing like it's something spiritually. It's your aura. It's your aura about you that people that are vibrationally, um, like higher vibrational than you, they automatic automatically gravitate to you. It's something about your energy boosting theirs up, them being able to inspire you to move up, which makes them, you know, kind of like get more power if you understand what I'm saying. And that's how it's supposed to go, right? I keep saying that marriage is not just love. It's a business. Business is love. That's a love language. Being protected, being provided for, not worrying about your safety. That's, yeah. <laughs> Why is the tower moment here for Scorpio? It says when God moves people out of your life, let them go. So for some of y'all, Scorpio, this person could have went to jail. Or this person could have chose somebody else over you because you pulling the nine of cups on your first card with the tower moment. Yeah, because I feel like whatever whatever situation it was with this person leaving your energy, it made way for your dreams. It's just as simple as that. Because I feel like whoever this person is, this emperor, I feel like maybe they've been in your energy or they've seen you before. Yeah, they've seen you before, Scorpio. What I said, the sun. So you pulling the nine of cup, the nine of cups, and the sun, Scorpio, <laughs> and you clarifying the tower moment. So this this painful ending, it just it brought you to to your blessing, to your purpose partner. This could be a twin flame from another life. In this life, they got their shit together. Or this just could be a purpose partner, Scorpio. Why is the nine of cups? In the sun here. I feel like you realizing something too about your dreams. Something different. You're revising them or something. Yeah. The eight of cups. I feel like you walking towards something bigger now, Scorpio. I feel like this, this nine of cups, this sun energy is giving you like you are the universe. You're operating in that same capacity, right? You don't have any limits. Just be natural. Just, just, I'm here. Just take off all the fluff and just be, not, just be you. That's, that's who the universe looking for. That's, that's the only person they can identify. They can't identify with all the people and the energies you picked up along the way. Who am I talking to? Fraud. That's what I'm talking about. All the frauds. You know how many frauds them been in the Scorpio life? Come on, Scorpio. You too solid not to know that. Excuse me. Let me turn this. Let me turn this off on my phone. I just thought about it. All right, sorry about this, Scorpio. Scorpio, you you encountered some frauds. You ain't even know they were fraud. Okay, <laughs> your your spirit guys just kept you from it. Why is fraud here for Scorpio? Look, the Eight of Swords in reverse. Somebody who wanted to make you think that you was in something that you couldn't get out of. The Six of Pentacles, what did I say? I feel like you realized at some point that what you was doing was what you wanted to do. Like you weren't in prison. You didn't have to be with this person. 
You could have moved on and been blessed. Whatever the reason was for you staying, Scorpio, it's the same reason you leaving. So, I mean, it's it's almost like a one and done. That's what I'm getting you, yeah, the Ace of Swords. Whoa. Did y'all see that? The Ace of Swords under the bottom of the deck. Hold on, guys. Look, it's still on the bottom, bitch. Like the whole deck done fell. It's still on the... Huh? Scorpio, I'm telling you. You, you got to recognize this, this power, man. Look at my phone ringing, guys. I just turned the Do Not Disturb off. Oh, come on, Scorpio. It's too much power in this room. It's too much power in this room. Look at that. Y'all y'all sitting right here witnessing this shit. I just put my Do Not Disturb on. Bro. I just, y'all was right here, right? Look. Do not disturb. It's on. Why my phone ringing? Scorpio. So the thing about it is just be natural. Because cause, cause I'm, I'm getting the energy like that's what don't need to be said here or whatever. This is um vitamin water, guys. Took me a walk this morning. Y'all look, look when the when the cars got back together off the ground. Look what's on there. the the hairpin. Stop playing with it. Ooh, child, Scorpio. Your power, I'm telling you, them demons. What I said, your power. The strength card, clarifying the six of pentacles. And the eight of swords in reverse, they can't, they can't, <coughs> <coughs> look at this, <coughs> they try, they don't want this message to get out. For one, they look like boo boo fucking fool because they underestimated you because you're not the type of person that talks so fucking much, you listen. A another thing about these narcissists slash whatever the fucks. They're not used to people really listening to them no way. So they really be telling you the truth all at the same fucking time And if you listen. Somebody underestimated you. Somebody underestimated your connection with the universe too. With the earth I just heard. Mother earth. Divine feminine. Somebody underestimated everything about you. For some of us, these toxic ass family members. Jealous of you and you laughing all the way to the bank. Why? Because you cut their ass off and out your life. And you've been going laughing all the way to the bank ever since then. Why is toxic family members here? People underestimate you, Scorpio, because you just, you that silent killer. Yeah, people think because you blindfolded or blindsided or don't see when they actually do the shit. Look at these vultures. I feel like I feel like this this you know like this uh covering your eyes or whatever when all these vultures around you I feel like that's spirit. That spirit saying let me protect you from this shit that's around you all the time. You won't even it won't even come. It's like vultures around you, Scorpio. That's the energy. They waiting on you to fail, give in, or conform. And it's like bitch, neither. With the blindfold on, neither. Yeah, the page of wands. I'm gonna take my chances. I feel like you're not playing it small no more. And the people that was telling you, oh, you was playing it small. And, oh, you on drugs. You'll never get your kids back and all this shit. Bitch, boo-boo the fool now. I'm back. I'm good. What's good? It's that type of energy for me. Yeah, they underestimated you. Why is this page of wands in the two of swords here? Somebody, somebody think you're not able to make a decision because of... Your maturity or some shit like that. It's like, girl, <laughs> the moon is in reverse. Clearly, I, I, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm actually reading your ass right now. On Twin Flame, you pulling the three of wands. You turned your back on whoever this is. You had to. I'm telling you, 
You walked away from something, Scorpio. Now, why did I hear that? <laughs> why is the three of wands here with the twin flame? Okay. The Knight of Pentacles is in reverse. Yeah, somebody, somebody expected you to like return back to them without knowing whether or not the details about the situation. Yeah, this could be some type of family dynamic with the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody just wanted you to... I feel like you left this person, Scorpio, or you, you turned your back on, on this person because of how they done you. And I feel like for some reason, this person trying to cash in their chips. This person back trying to make an offer. They want to reconcile. Now I'm getting the energy like that's the emperor. Because I was always feeling like you, like this person was coming from a place. I, I was thinking past life too. Like this person keep following you from past life. But it could be like this person just in your energy already. And I feel like too somebody, somebody didn't expect you to, to choose you Scorpio. Somebody expected you to just like keep on going on with this shit and being unhappy. And it was like. The universe showed you like ain't nothing wrong with your life. Move forward. And you just did that shit. You just walked away. For a lot of you Scorpios, you walked away from your whole house. You left with you and nothing. Some of y'all just you and your kids. But you had that promise from source that's like, wherever you going, I got you. This person back now trying to make an offer. They want to reconcile, reconcile with you, Scorpio. I'm hearing because of the kids. They they always use the kids as pawn. Even if this was like in your past here. Why is no here for Scorpio? It's like a definite no with this person. This person always been grimy. Yeah. The hangman in reverse. See, that's giving me that emperor energy. Like just stubborn. Just don't want to change their mind. But just think they can come. Come at you at a different approach. And then you will accept their offer now. It's like no. You still you. Why is the hangman here don't know? <laughs> Scorpio, people don't know you reading energy. I, ain't, I don't give a fuck what you saying out your mouth. Yo, when I said we listening, I'm talking about a whole nother frequency. I ain't talking about with our ears. Who am I talking to? What I said, the Ten of Cups. Scorpio, you already happy. Why would you put this shit in the mix? Because they offering you a Ten of Pentacles. You already got a Ten of Pentacles. You got a lot of Ten of Pentacles. You get a lot of offers, but not only that, your offer to yourself, what you got that you built for yourself, is sufficient. Just be natural. That's what I'm hearing. Like, just be you, the earth, the earth, you the salt of the earth. It's like, get your shit together to the point where can't nobody just dangle nothing the head in, in front of you and make you make a life changing decision just because you want to be happy and you, you know, you don't feel like you can make yourself happy. Build your life first, Scorpio. What I said, the Wheel of Fortune on the Ten of Cups. With the hangman in reverse on the no. You saying no to them and yes to you. What I said, the Six of Wands. People are recognizing you now, Scorpio. I mean, you've been there all the, all the while. <laughs> Hidden in plain sight. The Six of Wands clarifying the Eight of Cups. You walked away and, and got downright successful. In every walk of life, I feel like Scorpio, you emptied your tank. Just being you. Just being you. That's it. You ain't, you ain't trying to be nobody else, Scorpio. Why is the strength part here? People underestimate you just being you, not being enough. That's what I'm really trying to get at. Why is the strength card here? Why are you still the last man standing? That's what I want to hear about. The King of Wands. Why are you the last man standing, Scorpio? Because you did the work. You went into action. You went into action instead of seeking satisfaction. These people here, they just, they want to feel good all the time. They don't want to put in no work. They don't want no muscle soreness. Who am I talking to? This is who you've been dealing with. Why is the moon in reverse? The fool is coming out in reverse. Because you know what I'm hearing. I'm hearing there's something about this person in the moon. It's like 
they drink more or they just act the fucking fool when the fool when the moon fool. Or the new moon, this person act a straight jackass. This person an alcoholic or a drug addict. When they ain't drinking or smoking, they perfect. That's the only thing you holding on to. It's like, nah. That's what was going on with y'all. The manipulation of the children. This person on drugs and drinking and always trying to manipulate you and show out. I feel like, you know, the police was involved in all this shit. But look. Clarifying the Ten of Pentacles is the hair for the again. There you go showing up again, Scorpio. Like, my thing is you don't have to risk it no more. You realize you right where you supposed to be. You, you... You don't, you're coming from a place of a deep knowing. Now, I ain't got to keep on going this. I'm right. I'm right where I need to be. I'm parked, right? And this say reservation for who? Scorpio. I don't care what dream uh, Kool-Aid somebody trying to make you drink. You just not interested. The Wheel of Fortune is here clarifying the Ten of Cups with a hair fit. You earned your stripes, I just heard. <laughs> Everybody ain't happy about their wheel turning. Cause they want to, they wanted you to be up under that bitch when it turned Scorpio. So you got crushed and ain't what happened. That that's what happened to do. And you went straight to the top. The Ace of Pentacles, all type of doors being spiritually open for you, Scorpio. Cause what people don't realize is after a while, money ain't gonna be able to do it. The Queen of Wands is here. Money ain't gonna be able to do it. You're gonna have to already be in your element of spirituality. You're gonna have to already be operating in your powers and your gifts. And Scorpio, when I say ready, I'm talking about now. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing now. What I said, the Nine of Swords. I'm, I'm telling you now. I feel like some of y'all feel that energy. That's why y'all in this Nine of Swords. You just don't know what it is. Now you know. Because I'm telling you, you've been under the knife, yeah. The two of pentacles. A lot of us Scorpios are trying to balance out what's done and what need to get done. You know you did, you know you did a lot of groundwork with your healing, but it's like how do you measure it? The two of pentacles is in reverse because you seeking you seeking balance, Scorpio. You want peace, yeah. The ten of wands. I feel like you've been carrying a heavy load for a long time, and I feel like the universe is releasing you from it. It's like now people are able to see who you truly are. Yeah. The Four of Pentacles. I feel like you're getting into your bag now. I feel like also, like you are, you're the best kept secret, number one bestseller. Somebody could be um, writing a book, too, I just got. You could have already wrote three books that you didn't publish. Like, what are you waiting on? I'm hearing this fourth book is the book, but all three of the books, after you write the fourth book, it's gonna, they're going to be number one sellers too. They're going to want to read anything you wrote. I feel like you've been holding on to these other books too. Yeah, the Page of Pentacles. I'm telling you, it's time to let go of whatever that is. Go ahead and get it published, self-write it, whatever it is. I'm also hearing paperback. You don't have to spend the money for hard copy. It's the read. What else here for Scorpio? You have the Ten of Swords. A definitely a definite portrayal here, Scorpio. Make no mistakes about it. Because I feel like when it comes to us, how we love so hard or how we um, used to deem loyalty, I feel like it's always been situations where it have to be a betrayal in order for us to leave. That's the only way that we'll go. So that's why I always say just forget a person and move forward because... What's going on is God is moving you forward. He knew, God knows what it'll take to move you forward. Forward, So he do the thing that need to be done. Like the one thing you wouldn't, you wouldn't at all ever take from somebody. And so it breaks your heart because you, you're in a relationship with this person. You told them this hurt you and they did it deliberately, right? I'm telling you, this was a drunk, drug head. This bit was totally different. I'm getting um, Aries energy and Cancer heavy. Yeah, the Knight of Wands. Did somebody stay out all night, sleep around? And I just feel like this cycle just, you know, it ended. And I feel like ever since it ended, your life been on the up and up. The High Priestess here, I feel like you just don't want nothing to do with this person. Ain't no reconcile. The judgment is in reverse. 
It's like, ain't no do over do. You already fucked that up. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. Overall energy. Because I feel like, I feel like Scorpio is somebody new here. I f this person could even be younger than you. Not by a lot, but could be. Because age is significant here. They told me that. Um, But I feel like somebody is just what you need for right now is what I'm getting. But what I'm really getting is like this person, this ex, it's almost like they're trying to keep you at all costs. Like they just won't let it go already. No matter how much you move away or what you do, the person just like... They acting like they steal your fucking man is what I'm getting. And they know damn well they not. But they like, they really feel that way too. <laughs> or this could be them paying your bills still. You know, like alimony or some shit like that. Or them having to finally pay child support now. And it's like they ass out on the streets because of what they owe you. So now they trying to come around and be what? Let's see. Let's see what this person up to, Scorpio. Should've just paid the damn child support. That's why that judgment in reverse. This person that got a some type of court judgment, or you have Scorpio it went in your favor and not theirs, and this gonna end a long ass cycle for the high priestess. Like you've been going through this shit forever. Like this shit almost killed you. The Ten of Swords, but you move from the Ten of Swords to the Knight of Wands because when this shit over, this divorce or whatever the fuck it is, you feel free again. Yeah, you pulling fake number, trying to get a trying to get a hold of you through an unknown number, bitch. Mask. That's all that is. Da damage. They they have more. They have major holes in their aura. Yeah, we figured that, and they ain't done shit about them either. That's just what I'm getting. This person just. I don't know why this person is just like trying to follow you with the bullshit but I feel like it's somebody new yeah negative attitude they stay in a low vibrational energy yeah and you just don't you just don't rock with this person this person think you ignoring them or something but it's just I can't even hear you bitch we're not on the same frequency no more how dare you think you gonna come back in and what swoop me off my feet nah you are all it says an enemy is wanting to get close with you to gain something against you. I'm telling you. Because somebody writing a book. Somebody want to know if you writing about their ass. Yep. Look. Somebody want to know if you doing some dirty work Scorpio. They want to know if you writing about their ass. So they resurfacing. It says. They are having evil deities do the work for them. Yeah. This could be. This could be them like. Having. Having like. Astral travel or something. Where people are seeing what you're writing in your book Scorpio. Or like. Deities being around just to like hear what what your next move is, yeah. This person the one doing the fucking dirty work and always have done the dirty work. I'm hearing though that curse broke when the when the when the when the judgment was set, it it, it was over with. It broke every curse, every spell work, anything they done that was contrary to that. Yeah, core cool, cut. What I just said, y'all. This divorce or whatever the fuck this is, or you leaving your energy, taking your energy, it's cutting the cord here. It says, it is time, release them, cut them off, period. Some of y'all need to do a cut, a cut cord, a cord cutting ritual here. We have 333 guardians are by your side to assist you, just period. 333 could be very significant. It says, battle, they are putting you under a spiritual attack, but up. Um, put up protection and allow it to wear off. They will get their karma. Yeah, and I feel like that's what's going on, Scorpio. You could have been fatigued or like feeling tired, not wanting to get up and go or whatever, and you still push through that shit. Yeah, look, 444 in the bottom of the deck, it says, trust in the angelic realm that you are connected to, Scorpio. And that's the other thing. When you went up under the knife, you got connected to an entirely different angelic realm. And you're awakening to that. That's why this, this shit, it won't fly. People mad because you won't take them back. People mad because you said you forgive them, but you won't let them back in your life. You're not letting people have access anymore. And that's just what I'm getting from this. All right, Scorpio, if you're still with me, like, subscribe, join, let those ads play for a minute so your girl can get credit from YouTube. If you donate to the channel, make sure you go back to the comments and leave the money emoji. I will be... 
picking random people for free spiritual baths, free personal readings, and free memberships. I love you guys so, so much. I'll see you in the next video.